Yo, what's going on guys, it's Anime, and in today's video, I'm gonna be showcasing my 2021 gaming room setup. But before I say anything else, I just wanna say that everything in my room is bought by me, but more importantly, everything that I have in this room is completely because of you guys, my supporters. For everyone who watches my videos, watches my Fortnite music videos, listens to me on Spotify and Apple Music, thank y'all so much, man. I appreciate y'all, I love y'all. And also before I forget, if you guys enjoy setups and watching setup videos as much as I do, I ended up making a TikTok where I showcase different things on my setup, different PC tips and all that stuff. So if you're interested in that, be sure to go drop it a follow. Links on the screen as well as in the description. Without further ado guys, let's showcase my setup. So starting it off, we have a nice little overview of what my gaming room looks like when I first walk in, you know, couch, TV, whatever. So starting off in the very back of my gaming room, we have my ring light, which helps light the background of my videos. We also have a nice little shelf that I got on Target. It has a bunch of different stuff. Let's, uh, let's check it out real quick. So one of the coolest things that I have in my gaming room in the back is my G Fuel Tower. G Fuel, if you're watching this, please sponsor me. Next, we have a nice little skeleton for pop vinyl, some water brand tags, hashtag taxes, what's up? And then we got another Fortnite pop vinyl. So under my shelf, I have an LED light strip just wrapping around it, and I actually wired the wire, that's not a weird, but I wired the LED wire down below my wall with some cable raceways and whites. You can clearly see them on the camera that I'm recording right now, but in the back of my videos, it looks awesome. For my TV, it's just a regular TV, got an Xbox, if I want to play some video games, I didn't even bother to cable manage this, bro, I'm too lazy. These two things right here are called headbands, they're from the anime Naruto, I actually bought them when I was a kid because I really enjoyed that show. This next thing is really gonna seem like a flex but it's really just a flex towards me not towards y'all it's what i like to call my wall of inspiration just some designer things i've been able to buy with the money that i received from my music but really not just a flex yeah definitely not a flex why i took this shot so moving on to the bread and butter of my gaming room is my gaming setup this is a nice overview of it. The desk is actually from Amazon. To start things off, this is my streaming and recording PC. It's from Digital Storm, an i7-1080. If you're interested in any of the specs, it'll be down below in the description. So moving on to my triple monitor setup, the bottom two monitors are plugged into my gaming PC, while the top monitor is plugged into my streaming PC. The bottom monitor that I use the game on is an Alienware 240Hz, while the top and left monitors are both BenQ 60Hz monitors that have great color profiles. So moving on to what's on my desk, we got a mini Go XLR that I use to control my vocals and to actually run my dual PC audio setup on. Next we got a stream deck that I use to turn on my lights and also switch through scenes. And here's something really cool, my girlfriend's mom actually got me this. It's an iPhone stand that charges your phone, man, like how cool is that? So because I am running a dual PC setup, I do have two different sets of keyboard and mice. So for my streaming PC, I have a Logitech G Pro keyboard and a Logitech Pro mouse. They look pretty cool, man. They do their job. But now moving on to the beast, bro. We have my gaming and editing PC. So inside my PC, we got an i9-9900 being cooled by Lens EXT's Kraken Z3. It's got two fans and this cool little screen that I can put any kind of gift that I want. For my RAM, we got four sticks of the G-Skill Royal Trident. It's something like that, man. It looks beautiful. So now we got the beast within the beast, man. The NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3080. This thing is an absolute tank. It makes my PC run amazingly. And this right here is my custom $300 keyboard, man. It's awesome. It looks a lot better in person than it is on camera. It kind of upsets me that it doesn't look as great on camera, but it's whatever. So this is a custom keyboard core. It doesn't enhance the keyboard at all, but it looks nice and I like it. The gaming mouse I have for my gaming PC is the lightest mouse in the world. It's called the Cape Town 2 and it is awesome. And all of my peripherals sit on my new custom mouse pad that I got from Gutsy Aiden. So probably one of the most important things in my setup is my microphone. It's a Shure SM7B. It's what I use to record all of my music and it's the reason that I sound so good in all my videos and songs. The camera that I use to record all my videos with is the Canon Rebel SL2 and I got a Sigma 60mm lens. And for my headphones, we got the SteelSeries Arctis 5s. They're pretty good. I probably am due for an upgrade with my headset, especially because I record music, but we'll get to that when we get to that. 
But that's my setup, guys. I hope y'all did enjoy it, man. And once again, thank y'all so much for the support y'all have given me in my channel. It's greatly appreciated. I love y'all. Thank y'all so much. And if you liked the video, drop a like. Subscribe to the channel if you are new. And I'll see y'all in the next one. Goodbye.